For young and old, big and small, reading can open doors. Reading for me is very, very important because when I was growing up, I was um, very scared at school. I, I was different. Uh, all the other kids at school could read and I couldn't. My Mommy Couldn't Read was written in 1999. It has since earned several literary awards. I have four children. My 21-year-old, he was the reason why I started to learn how to read. I had graduated high school with low level of literacy skills, and when I became pregnant with him, I realized that reading was so important that a mother was supposed to read a bedtime story. Today, Carrie Rigby Wilcox is the author of three children's books. She has become a literacy advocate. Wilcox, along with 11 other authors and illustrators, set up at the Community Arts Centre to celebrate literacy in Prince Albert. With books in tow, they shared their stories with the public. It's called Captain Ed's Fire Safety Book, and I've been with the uh, Saskatchewan Fire Protective Services for 35 years and retired as fire captain. The displays help kids relate to many of the books. It's a unique book in that it rhymes, but also gives a lesson plan, and this book will tell you what to do and what not to do. <laughs> Educators say puppets are a good way to draw young children into a book. Tips from the authors can be useful for parents and caregivers to use at home. Just the love of books and just to pick up a book wherever you are and sit with your child. So family literacy and modeling for, for your children is probably the most important thing. And meeting the person who wrote the book can also encourage young people to read it. The next Literacy Day in Saskatchewan will be the winter of 2013. For Shaw, I'm Lisa Rizzo.